I signed up with RMO Agency because um, I actually owned a construction company for 10 years past uh, that, but I was never able to qualify as a, being an independent contractor because I never had anybody to sh provide proof of experiences. So signing up with the RMO program, I was able to meet up with another contractor and with them, working with me for a couple years, they gave me the proof of the experiences I needed to be able to qualify for my own licensing. Oh, Marmo Dario was wonderful. Uh, not only because he's already been in the trades for a numerous number of years, so he was able to help me out on some items that I didn't know, but we were also able to uh, tag team some things together and also share valuable information across each other. So we helped each other out. It was really nice. Make sure you stay with your scheduled meetings with your uh, RMO. It's, it's definitely the number one. Uh, paperwork is also going to be number two. Make sure you always have a copy of your own paperwork. Think of it as your own business, even though, you know, it is your business. It's your business. You're just bringing this RMO to help you build a better business or get a specific licensing scene for your business. So make sure you own it. That was the first couple months that I was with Dario um, it was a little difficult I didn't want him kind of coming on my jobs I was a little big on you know meeting him and stuff you didn't want somebody to step on your toes but then after the first couple months I was like you know what this person is technically someone that's a part of my company and that's what you have to remember they're gonna be a part of your company so allowing them to come into your business see your business attributes see how you run your business take their input in to make your business better is the number one thing that I probably tell other people joining into the program. You know, make that person viable to you. Make that RMO, you know, a part of your business, a part of who, what company you are. That's really the main thing. Ease. Ease is the easiest thing I've experienced. Oh my goodness. I, I've dealt with the CSLB for a numerous number of years three different licensings before finally getting my uh, the builder license, the General B. And it's just allowing you guys to fill out all the forms, do all the documentation, have all of the reports and everything needed for all the, uh, the monthly records. Not only that, but when it also came time for me to take the test, I filled out the application and I sent it over to the RMO company. And then the gals over there, ran it over through, I corrected a couple items on it, and then they helped me submit it in, so that way you guys follow through the whole process. It's not like they're just filling out information, having someone help you, and then leaving you high and dry, no. And then the portal, the portal's also, you know, the most important thing too, because with that, you can always go back, even now after Dario and I are done, and I'm thinking about becoming my own RMO, you know, that portal, I could go back and look at all of our prior records, the jobs, pictures, and all that other for future job references. So it's, it's a great, it's great information feed.